very eventful day. Top of the first, Todd Zeal at the plate against Ron Martinez. Two on. Zeal in the right center. Everett obviously did not rent the Tom Amansky defensive drills video. It's endorsed by Fred McGriff. Edgardo Alfonso and Mike Piazza come to score. Two run double, two not the Mets. Bottom of two. One out count to Everett. Now watch the home plate umpire, Ron Kulpa, stepping in and stopping play to advise Everett that he's over the line. The batter's box line. Everett and Kulpa. A bit of a discussion here. It'll get worse. Jimmy Williams wants to be involved. And he can be because he's the manager, but Everett says he's cool, everything's okay. Everett digs in once more, and again beyond the line. Now go back to Friday, Everett got hit in the arm by Dennis Cook, but Cook went to explain that Everett only got hit because he was so far over the line. So obviously the Mets tipping off the umpire that Everett's up to that on Saturday, 2-2 count, Everett digging in, erases the line, the umpire back in to discuss, and Everett has seen enough, walks away in disgust. Williams back out. This time he stays out to get involved. Everett then gets into it with Kulpa some more. And he is tossed. It's an antonym, not a homonym. You can't handle the truth. Everett ejected and then stays for more. Really loses it here. Irate bumps into the ump, not once, but twice with the chest. And then the headbutt. And a reminder, this was family day at Fenway. <laughs> Tommy Harper, tailwind Tommy Harper, who led the American League in stolen bases in 1969 information. Wendell Kim, Jimmy Williams, they try to control their guy, and yank him off the field. This is this, he explains to his players, but did not want to have his bodily fluids replenished with liquid. He knocks over the container. Everett Dunn still trying to explain his case to his guys. What?